subscribe to InfoZone channel and press the bell icon for latest videos. Hey guys, welcome back again. Today in this video, I will show you how to troubleshoot the could not install Windows 10. The installation failed in the first boot phase with an error. So first, solution number one, you disable your firewall temporarily. You open run command, hold the window key and press R. Now you type here control space firewall dot cpl. After you click on OK. And the next, you select the turn windows firewall on or off. Next, next you select this turn off windows firewall not recommended. After you click on OK and close and restart your PC hopefully it will fix your issue solution number two you check your windows update you go to start and open the settings you select the update and security next click on windows update and in the right side you check here guys check for update option if your windows update is available you update your windows and try Solution number 3. You hold the window key and press R. Type here msconfig and hit enter on your keyboard. Now you select here, select you startup. First you uncheck this load startup items. Next check this load system services. Next go to the service tab. You check here, hide all Microsoft services. Next click on disable all. After click on apply and ok. And restart your PC. Solution number 4. Using command prompt. You go to start. Now type here command prompt. You right click here. And select the run as administrator. So first the command for the rename your software distribution folder first command netface stop space w u a u s e r p after you type and hit enter on your keyboard and wa wait for this complete next type here second command netface stop space c r y p t s p c and hit enter again on your keyboard and wait again so cr successfully and the third one command you type net space stop space bits and hit enter type the fourth one command net space stop space msi server and hit enter again and after this type here two commands i will give you in my description link you can copy and paste here REN space C colon backward slash windows backward slash software distribution space software distribution dot hold after you hit enter on your keyboard and type this second command REN space C colon backward slash windows backward slash system 32 backward slash cat root 2 space start cat root 2 dot hold and hit enter on your keyboard and after this you need to type four command for the start your windows update services type the first command net space start w u a u s e r p and hit enter and next type this second command net space start space c r y p t s v c after hit enter again on your keyboard Type the third one command net space start space bits and hit enter again. Type here last fourth one command net space start msi server after you hit enter. Close your command prompt, restart your PC. Hopefully, it will fix your issue. And the next solution, you go to your restart, type here command prompt, right click on, select the run as administrator. 
you type here hfc space forward slash scan now after you hit enter on your keyboard so guys you need to wait for a long time for complete this process you can see here 0% you need to wait for complete the 100% if this command not work you try the second one command I will give you in my description you again open run command command prompt as administrator and now you type this command I will I will give you in my description you copy from there and paste here after you hit enter on your keyboard and wait for the complete next you type the three commands so first one this command you can copy from description you copy and paste here and hit enter the second and third command you can see on my display scan health and restore health you paste one by one hit enter and complete this after close your command prompt if this command not work you try the next one command you can see this command you can copy from my description you paste this command after you hit enter on your keyboard after this restart your PC hopefully it will fix your issue and still you facing the same problem you try the last one co method last solution you check your C drive space you hold your window key and press E open the file explorer and select the disk PC and in the right side you see here guys local disk C you check here guys your C drive space if this drive have no space you need to clean all temporary files history junk cookies so for this guys you right click on your C drive go to the properties go to the general and click on this disk cleanup button you click here you need to wait here for a long time and now here you check the all contents you read one by one and check which type of files you want to delete the temporary file 60 catch cookies where you read and check and the next you click on clean up system files button you click here after again you wait again you check here all contents for the confirmation you read and check next click